it's Sam again, and today I'm going to show you how to jailbreak how to jailbreak any iPod Touch or iPhone on firmware 3.1.2 using an application called Black Rain, and you can do this for on Windows and Mac. And yes, it does work for the iPod Touch third gen and the iPhone 3G, and I'm pretty sure it also works for the iPhone 3GS. And then it works for all the other iPods and iPhones. And the only catch with the iPhone 3G and 3GS and the iPod Touch 3rd Gen is that it's a tethered jailbreak. So if, you're, if you completely shut off your iPod or if it runs completely out of battery and then shuts off, then you have to go back to the computer you jailbroke it with and run the application again and then just uh, it'll boot back up. And it's, it's extremely easy but it's just a hassle if, if you run out of battery and you're like not at your house or something but it's not a big deal if you especially if you have a car charger or if you're just around your house most of the time or you just bring your laptop everywhere you go <laughs> so uh... now that i got all that cleared up then what you're gonna want to do first is open up itunes Okay, so once iTunes opens up, uh, wait for the Devices tab to pop up, and then go to your iPod, and then it, once you're in there, you're just going to click Restore, and then it's going to ask you if you want to back up your information and stuff. Just select Yes, and uh, and so yeah, go through all that, and then just uh, once it's restored, exit off of iTunes. Don't minimize, you have to exit. And then... Uh, and the reason you have to exit is because when you jailbreak it, if you're on iTunes, you, you just don't want to be on iTunes. Because it's going to like give you error signs and stuff. Okay, so then open up any internet browser and go to blackrain.com. Oops. Blackrain.com. And as you can see, instead of an I, it's the number one. And so then just uh, search it. And then once you're on it, it's going to look exactly like this. And if you're a Mac user, click on the Mac icon. And if you're a Windows user, click on the Windows icon. And then you can just save it anywhere you can find it. I'm going to save it to my desktop. And it'll take like a second to download. Okay, so here's the black rain icon. Right there. And so now... I'm gonna show you the rest of the steps. Uh, I'm gonna switch over to my camera now. Okay, so make sure your iPod is plugged in or iPhone, and make sure it's plugged into your computer. And then make sure you're off of iTunes. And then, um, as you can see, mine's already jailbroken, so it's gonna go a little bit quicker for me. But what you're gonna wanna do is hold down the power button on the top, and it's going to say slide to power off. Just completely shut it off. There we go. So make sure it's completely shut off. I think it is. So now I'm going to go on Black Rain and open it. And I'm going to click Run. And then this is pretty much just the easiest jailbreak in the world. All you have to do is click Make It Rain. And then if your i if it's not jailbroken yet, since mine's already jailbroken, it's not going to turn on automatically. But if yours isn't jailbroken yet, it's probably going to turn on automatically and start doing it. But if it doesn't, just turn it on. And then instead of the Apple logo, you're going to get this uh, this guy that was on BlackRain.com. And you're going to have a little bar down there that keeps spinning. And then it's eventually just going to go on to your iPod uh, menu. And if it doesn't, if, if it just, just keeps spinning and it's nothing's happening, just hold down the home button and the power button for like 20 seconds until it completely shuts off. And then you can just try again. And, okay, hold on a second. Let me go back to my computer really quick. Okay, so it says, your jailbreak is done, blah, 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 enjoy, and all that other stuff. 
and I think it, and then, yeah, what's, what's going to happen is, mine's just going to go right, right and turn on, but since yours isn't jailbroken yet, I'm pretty sure it's going to reboot, and then it's going to come up, and, uh, you're going to be able to go on. And so, if yours, if yours isn't jailbroken, since mine's already jailbroken, I already got a ton of apps and everything. But what's going to happen is you're just going to have a regular, it's going to look like you just got your iPod Touch, like, out of the box. And you're just going to have, like, the mail, YouTube, contacts, and all the other stuff. And if you scroll over to the second page, right there is going to be this Black Rain app. And you can just open that up. And you can download Cydia or Rock. I suggest Cydia. Because I've heard there's some problems with Rock. And yeah. So once you download Cydia. And you got the Black Rain app. And if that all worked out for you. Then congratulations. Your iPod Touch or iPhone is now jailbroken. Thanks YouTubers for watching. Please feel free to rate, comment, and subscribe. And have a nice day. Thanks YouTubers. Bye.